All right. So let's say that you have a project that you want to send over to somebody like a mixing engineer. Um, maybe you're sending it back to a producer or an artist and you just want them to check it out. You're working off of Logic Pro X. So this is what we got so far in this project. All right, so we're gonna send this over. And what we're gonna do is go up to file and in file, there's two ways to do it. You can do a save a copy as what it's going to do is just going to make a copy of what you are working on currently. It is not going to really make more of a changes out of it. It's just making a quick copy of what you've got in that original copy that you first opened up. So this, this I'm just gonna get a copy of it. Save as any changes that I made in this project that I did today, regardless of what I had done the other days, whatever I did today, and if I haven't saved basic saving, save as is going to make a separate folder or package for that particular um, changes that I made. So on this particular one, I just want to make send it over from what I have, go save a copy as. And what I normally do is if I'm sending it to somebody, I'm going to make another little folder in that section I have it. As you can see, I have some other saved projects for it. And what we're going to do just for testing purposes is make a test folder within the one I already had. Put this one test and send it through. Now, one thing I did not do to check because of this particular one, but when you do it, make sure that you're sending all the necessary files with it. Make sure you're sending the audio files if you recorded anything, samplers, Alchemy Audio, Ultra Beat, anything that you use out of here, make sure you're sending all that with too as well. So if we look over and we go to our finder, see test is in there, we see our project folder, and here's everything that we're going to send. We can then Go back to this one, this main thing, compress it, and that's what we're going to send.